out of nowhere this afternoon. Union Square disintegrated into pandemonium. Spontaneous mosh pit of violence and fighting with top police brass under attack by thousands of people, many of them pre-teens who mobbed innocent New Yorkers just trying to pass by. And the only thing I could think about was trying to keep my daughter safe. Jaylene took cover with her one-year-old in an ATM lobby as she watched a police officer get sucked into the crowd. He ended up getting beaten and jumped by, I want to say, over like 10 people. Every available officer was commanded to rush to the scene to restore order as members of the crowd raided a construction site in the middle of the square and vaulted a million projectiles at each other and police. Cops racked up so many arrests, they filled three city buses with prisoners Freeze all that. and frantically worked to clear a route to back those buses out of the mayhem. I had thousands of kids out there. I needed thousands of parents out there. All those kids had been summoned to Union Square Park by a social media influencer named Kai Sinat, who has 20 million followers online. He told them he'd hand out gaming consoles. Police saw his initial post and sent officers to monitor a group that at first numbered just 300. But then the post went viral. 300 became at least 3,000. This is a group of young people, and we had to be very, very delicate in how we handled this. All right, we wanted the kids to just comply with us and leave, but we were met with a lot of resistance. We were attacked. My older brother just called and told me he saw a video of me getting hit in the head. I'm not against young people coming here. If we knew about this, we could have had the barriers out here. We could have police officers out here. We could have did this orderly. They could have gave uh, whatever gifts they had for the young people away. Eventually, police managed to convince the influencer to leave the crowd. He sped away through city streets with loyal followers clinging to the outside of his Escalade and falling off one by one. So much drama for, it seems, absolutely nothing. Get that camera on my face, bro. Get back with a new video. It's one thing to just come and try and support him, but to come and make a mess of not just the city, but of just other pedestrians like me that are just trying to get by and go throughout their day. It's just, there's no consideration and it's ridiculous, honestly.